Don't let greed, jealousy, poverty define you. This is coming from Nollywood actress Victoria Nyama. In an Instagram post, she said, Do not let anyone define you. Our roots have all already done that in the most complicated ways. You can change that. We are all infinitely um, complex beings. We should not be our jobs or diagnoses or anything of sorts. Always define yourself in a realistic, expansive way so that we clearly see when others are trying to define us in their own terms or in relation to what they want us to be. Um, it's a lot, but I think those are the key um, part of her. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, like, I like the word, um, in the, in the, always define yourself in a realistic, expansive way, in a progressive way, in an open-minded way. And in the life of me, I don't even know. I've, I've been Victoria Yama was one of those queen goddesses that graced our screen. I mean, those are the first mm -hmm. queens of Nollywood. Um, all of a sudden, she just she just vanished. Like nobody yeah, had she, any from she her. She to focus on other things. You know, and yeah. um, it's that there's much pressure that society put on people. And if you're not one who is strong in yourself, and you've been able to at least maybe on your journey to self discovery, you found out a, a great part of you that will keep you always stable and and level-headed, you always get swayed by things that come up every day because the things out there every single day. And things that really don't matter, second, even say, when they seem like they it, matter yeah. in yeah. You know, so the smaller picture. You begin to lose focus on what really you should be paying attention to. So I see I see a generation focusing on what they shouldn't necessarily be focusing on and you know, leaving aside what really does matter. And mm -hmm. it's worrisome. You know, um, growing up, there, there were a lot of values my, my, my parents instilled into us. And these days, it doesn't matter any longer. Mm. And people will actually tell you, just leave people to do whatever they want to do. And, and that is why it's okay we can have robbers on our street because leave them, let them rob, yeah. let them do whatever they want to do. Mm. <laughs> you know? um, let me defend my millennials. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're please. We're not thieves. We're not, we're not that, like that. We're not that no, I'm, not, I'm, not, no, I'm, I'm just saying, I'm not saying they are. You know, because it's still in this, let people do what they want to do. People tell you it's let okay for them to be Let people do what they stars, want to do, you know absolutely. What I mean? But it okay, doesn't mate. mean that they should do things that are wrong. But it's still us doing what we need to do. If I want to collect some of this money, it's what I want to do. Don't you get it? I, I mean, um, that's I what I want to do. I don't think that's what anyone do. is talking yeah. about, but... Um, I no, it goes with that saying. Mm, let people no, do what they want to no, do. No, I think it's I, I think it's very different. I, I, I think the the statement is not the problem. It's the li it's the person's listening ears that's the problem. And I, sorry, you, I also think that comes into play when they're talking about um, personal decisions that have got to do with an individual alone. So a person says, yes. "I don't want to get married," and you're bothered. Yeah. A person says, "I'm not attracted to man. I'm attracted no, to no, woman." No, 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 a person so says, those, "I want to be a frost." We're frosters. A person says, "I want to be frosters." But that's 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 it does not play with that. Because no, no, it's not moral. Yeah, it is illegal. Yeah. So, so the uh, law cannot, should yeah. do the job. Mm. Yeah. Should but it's, it's it's illegal for people. But to are you be, saying that in your generation, people didn't yeah, actually yeah. fraud, like do scamming? Like that has nothing to do with the statement. And I think that that statement in is that very... generation was when four one nine. Exactly. Yeah. Those are even thought of. Let's not try to make it this bad because it's just because there was no social media. You can't really say. It's because there was no social media, so it wasn't in our faces. Yeah. But was I in an environment where I saw a lot of them and they were the big deal and they're like ah the four that people are co is coming to this restaurant today. I mean, we all grew up around yeah. it, so we know. I mean, I like her statement, but for me personally, I think it's always good to know where you are right now. Mm. Um, I think that really... I'm not. I'm not anything else. I'm not yesterday's Ife. I'm not tomorrow's Ife. I am today. Ife right now. Yeah. So... It, it sounds nice, but I, I still think I need to know that, okay, I, right now my account is broke, so I am broke. And then that would affect how I'm going to make a decision tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I, where, where I can gain from her is where she's saying, with your thinking, and not your reality, because those are two different things. Yeah. With your thinking, you can, I like the word that she used, expansive. Mm -hmm. yeah, expansive um, yeah. It's very easy to be crippled by where I am today, but it's just as important to know where I am today. So those two color colorations are very powerful. Like I know that, okay, my bank account doesn't look very sweet now, and then my expansive mind helps me to get to where I want to be. I can agree to that, but I'm always very careful um, about when people start to advise like that. Like, don't care about where you are. Don't care about the haters. Don't care about the... No, 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 no. I think you should care. I think you should take a, a step back. But about then, the that, should that then consume you? No. But is there a, a need to evaluate and like really examine? And how can you do that if you are only digesting your own information, like mm. your own self 
reasoning. Like, it's not like, going to yeah. work. You need to yeah. take everybody's thing into perspective, see the bad, see the good, and then digest, you know, the, the real stuff. You, you know, I think, I think should, when, when, when people say, um, don't care about what people say, it's not necessarily you not caring about what they say. It's and actually not, say not, don't care letting, about what people not say. letting them um, put a stop gap to what it is you want to achieve or what it is you want to do. Like, I hate to worry. The water outside right. the ship does yeah. not affect when, when, the ship. I, I mean, mm. we, we, all, we all go through stuff every single day. But you still need you know, the water so, to, you know, so. um, We go through uh -huh. stuff. Every human being goes through stuff. We have something everybody's dealing with. But this is me. I don't focus on that. And I mean, uh, because each time I do, it puts me in the state I don't want to be. So mm. I'm thinking solution. I'm thinking, okay, hey, I'm thinking outcomes. This is what I want. This is this how I want to see these turn out at the end of the day. You know, and yeah, talking about um, don't focus on haters. I mean, sometimes we have imaginary haters. I don't... People you just, just people, you don't even have one at but all. Anyway, so focus I, I, on I, you I, and, yeah. and do what you need to do to make yourself better. Like you rightly said, I, I bother a lot of time when, sorry, it's me. Um, you don't read, you, you're, not, you're, not, you're not improving in your IA, your, 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 um, your AI, your artificial intelligence. You're not improving on your emotional intelligence. What, then what exactly are you doing to ensure that, you know, your present reality is going to improve, it's going to be better? Like, <laughs> because you gotta, put in, you gotta put in some work, you gotta do some stuff to help expand it. You know, you need to do some stuff. There's some work you need to do to make tomorrow better. So if you're here today and you don't like your reality and you're not making any effort that will improve on tomorrow, mm. you'll come into tomorrow and what your reality now is going to be your reality tomorrow. So mm. many people are not putting in the work to make their life any better. They're just wishing, wishful thinking. It, it never got anybody better. Yeah, I like when you said um, that you should know where you are oh, right now yeah. because I think knowing where you are is very important and also understanding the dynamics of where you are and mm, where you want to content, be. Yeah. So if you are in a particular place, you need to find a purpose for that place you're in and not be the person that can be easily swayed for little things or things like I said earlier that looks nice when you're looking at it in smaller yeah. um, image of it but when it gets to the bigger picture it's actually very relevant mm. so um, just really know yourself know where you are accept your flaws I know I say this a lot mm. um, it might seem um, um, like it's not necessary but if you do not accept your flaws that is the only time mm. that when people say things about you it gets to you I yes. mean if I know for example that I'm short mm. and you think that is what you want to use every time to torment me I can even help you sing the chorus mm. else is a short girl <laughs> Do you understand? So, of course, that's like very flimsy, even though it's a deep thing for some people yeah. because sometimes people actually cry themselves to sleep from comments or um, observations that are said by other people. As you about their body. Yeah, image, so yeah. Um, whatever it is, own the good parts of your life, own the bad parts of your life, understand where they come into play. Mm. And please, I always say this thing. Your privilege is important. Mm. Don't say you don't have a privilege. If your privilege is your beauty, use it. So no matter how mundane your privilege is to someone, it is your privilege. Yeah. And if they have they it, not, not apologize for it, they will use it. Yeah, yeah. please don't apologize no. for it. It is highly important. So this conversation, I like what Victoria Yama does on her page every mm. time because she doesn't just put out her beautiful self. She's always putting captions that would help you, especially when you're ready to listen. Because yeah. sometimes people follow these things, but... Uh, They'll still go on to it.